After Harvey, millions of dollars in donations poured into the city as fast as the water rose, all of it designed to help our neighbors in need. Mayor Sylvester Turner and Harris County Judge Ed Emmett set up the Hurricane Harvey Relief Fund and raised $114 million. A year after the storm, Channel 2 Investigates is tracking how that money has been spent. Amy Davis reveals which areas of Houston got the most financial assistance and how you still can apply for help from this fund. See it today, it's a blessing from above. More than a year after the storm, flood victims are finally seeing progress. They're fixing the floors, they're gonna fix the walls, and probably the ceiling, new roof. So actually I'm gonna get like a new house. Local agencies like Avenue Community Development Corporation, Build Aid, and Fifth Ward Community Redevelopment Corporation. I couldn't do it without, a, I didn't have the money. Are using money from the Hurricane Harvey Relief Fund to get the most vulnerable Harvey victims back home. Low income people, the elderly, the disabled, veterans, undocumented children. Um, and so those were set as the priority populations for the fund. Renee Wizig Barrios with the Greater Houston Community Foundation helped manage the fund at no cost. A the $114 million raised, nearly $109 million has already gone to agencies helping victims. Those agencies tell Channel 2 they've used just over half the money they've received. They've got another year to use the rest. The money was doled out to 123 organizations, and in the early months after the storm, most of it was spent on basic needs for victims and temporary housing for families who had no place to go. Groups like North Channel Assistance Ministries provided necessities like food and cleaning supplies. It means a lot. It, it, it helps. So far, agencies report providing help to 150,000 Harris County households, and they're on track to help a total of 190,000 by the end of next year. The zip code where Harvey victims receive the largest share of financial assistance is 77028. 396 households in the area between Homestead Road and Mesa Drive received emergency money. 382 households received financial help in 77036, which includes the Sharpstown area on the southwest side. And 271 households received money in 77026, back on Houston's east side. Almost half of the people we've served are renters, so not everyone in Harris County who needed help was a homeowner. Nursing student Crystal Wicks is a homeowner. There was stuff everywhere, like my walls were falling down. The goal is to repair a total of 2,000 homes in two years. Costs range from twenty dollars to $30,000 per home. This is heaven to my eyes right now. Charities like Habitat for Humanity have the money to fix another 1,000 homes. The foundation has created a website to make it easy to apply for help. They can go to one place, get matched, and move that process along very quickly. That website is harveyhomeconnect.org, and charities are still looking for homes to repair. We put a link on our website, clicktohouston.com. I'm Amy Davis, KPRC, Channel 2 News.